Hello everyone and welcome to my channel Zen Within Me. Today's reading is going to be for Virgo Sun Moon Rising and it's going to be your general reading. Okay, so without further ado, my darlings, let's get into it. Okay. Guides, guardians, ancestors, and angels, please give me clear and concise messages for Virgo Sun Moon Rising. What's going on in their life at this time? What general messages do you have for Virgo at this time? What does Virgo need to know? Please continue to protect us, watch over us, and guide us always. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, Virgo. What's up? What's up? What's up? Let's see what's going on. Okay, the Hierophant. So some of you may be married, you may be dealing with um, work, if you work in like a major corporation, it could also be like a church or something like that. So let's see, what about it? it could even be a mentor, having to do with tradition, maybe something for the holidays, your beliefs, let's see, okay. You may be dealing with an air sign person, Libra, Gemini, or Aquarius. Okay. Could also be somebody that's very um, to the point and honest. No bullshit kind of personality. If it's not an air sign person. Okay, so this could be your mentor. This could be someone you're in the relationship with. This could be um, your boss at work. Let's see. Can you give us some more details, some more information, please, for Virgo? Okay, one more, please. If not, I'll just go to the oracles. Oracles it is. Okay, the tarot has spoken. They said, girl, you ain't listening. <laughs> I said, no, I'm done. Okay, okay, okay. We gotta give it one more shot. Okay. So what other messages do we have for Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising regarding this reading? What does Virgo need to know at this time, please? Okay, let's see. Clarity. Okay, you need some clarity regarding a situation involving this person. However, this commitment may be, relationship, work. Okay, last shuffle. What are the messages? It didn't come out. Okay, that one came out. You guys, you know how I roll. They got to come out. Okay. Okay, the source. Okay, so for some of you, you may be talking to a church official. Uh, you may be going to confession about this person because you need some advice. If you're dealing with someone at work, you're going to end up speaking to the higher ups or if this person is your boss, you're going to end up talking to them like they're the source source because they're the higher up regarding this. So you guys know if this resonates with you, what this is, how this resonates with you. So I don't need to know the details because this message is for you. Okay. Okay. So if there is something that you need clarity on, you will get it. If you're wondering who do you go to to get it, and it's like a work-related thing, then you need to find this air sign person or this person that's very blunt and will tell you like it is. Okay? So Libra Gemini or Aquarius or someone that's just very blunt. And they're going to give you that clarity. And then if you're dealing with an air sign person and you're going to church to... Like I said, confession, you'll get the answers that you need, okay? Because you're going to the source. You're going to the higher power, okay? Okay, thank you. 
So now messages from the archangels and the animals. We have wolf. Be independent but work together. Archangel Zariel. So for some of you dealing with work, it might be an issue where it's like, okay, um, whoever you're working with is not doing their part. And you're going to need to like, you know, bring this to someone's attention before something goes wrong and then you get blamed. Be disciplined in your home and community life. Dog, Archangel Zariel. This to me is also loyalty. I always associate loyalty with these cards because dogs are loyal as fuck. <laughs> I curse on occasion. That's just the way I talk. Um, and for some of you that are new that are watching. Um, okay. I don't apologize because that's who I am. You got to love me the way I am. Love me and leave me alone. Just like everyone else. You want somebody to accept you the way you are fully, right? So no hypocrites here. We uh, tell it like it is and give the same in return. Okay, so next card we have is Eagle. Seize opportunities courageously. Archangel Bokpi. Yeah, so if you have an opportunity here to keep yourself out of hot water as far as like work goes or to let management know that you are open to an opportunity, you jump all over that shit. Okay, so let's now go to the Moonology deck. As far as loyalty goes, sorry, I didn't get to finish um, commenting on that. If you're feeling that there is a loyalty issue, maybe you were not faithful and that's why you want to go to church and confess because you need to handle it that way, you know, or you feel the person you're with is not being faithful, so you're going to talk about that like I said before you know exactly what's going on in your life so you know how this resonates with you okay so what other messages do we have for Virgo Sun Moon Rising thank you last shuffle any other messages for Virgo thank you So we have three cards here. Look at the bigger picture. Full moon in Sagittarius. Okay, so you may be dealing with a Sagittarius. The full moon, as far as timing goes, may be relevant to you. It may also be at the time of full moon in Sagittarius. Everyone's going to watch this video at different times. It's a timeless reading. So just look it up to see when it's relevant for you. Okay, but you have to look at the bigger picture here. And that's what you're trying to do with clarity. Okay, you and your loved ones are safe. New moon in Cancer. You may also be dealing with a Cancer. And the final card. A personal issue reaches resolution. Full moon in Cancer. Okay, so there you have it. You may be dealing with a Cancer and it may be this air sign person or the energy of this air sign person that brings this to a resolution. Okay, so your personal issue is going to reach a resolution. Maybe this priest or whoever you're speaking to is that air sign person. Okay. So the universe is trying to give you that connection as to where this person is and who you're dealing with. Okay. So let's grab some initial cards here for you, Virgo. Okay. Okay. We have an M. I'm hearing ma'am and Martha. S. D. All right, so I'm saying like Miss D, Misty maybe, or Ms. M. S. D. Uh, initial for someone. Getting Delia, Delilah, Darlene, Darla, Desmond, Deidre. 
Okay, P. Okay. Okay, so we have MSDP. So however that resonates with you guys. Thank you so much for watching, liking, and subscribing. Peace and love. I will see you in the next reading.